Hello and hi everybody, welcome back to another one. Before I get into this, if you're new to the channel and you haven't yet subscribed and liked the video, then be sure to do so right now. And have social medias if you're interested in following me. I have Twitter and Instagram, they're both linked down below in the description. And I do have other channels, my second reaction channel and my gaming channel, which those channels will be active soon. I just been incredibly busy recently and I know I promised this summer I would get those channels back up and running, but I will try to do that soon. I just know I'm gonna be busy uh, a lot this summer so but I would try my best to get those channels up and running occasionally so if you haven't yet subscribed to those channels the links to those will also be in the description and let's try to get this video to about 150 likes so with that being said we are here for the newest SMO movie Junior's Sports Drink I don't know what this is really going to be about um I know I didn't get to this uh last night or yesterday whenever this video came out I was out with my girlfriend's family all day working half the time and just being with them uh the rest of the day i've been doing that the last few days i've just been with her family most of the time so um that's why i didn't get to this video initially um i know recently i've been really late on smo videos like i don't get to them like till the next day i've been doing that a lot and i hate when that happens but you know that's just life you know i have a life i have things that are going on and just have to accept that so but i'm here now and i'm here to get to it so with that being said if you haven't yet subscribed to smo then be sure to do so the links to the original will be in the description so with that being said let's get into this junior you stupid friends you loaded big potatoes already what is oh, what is on the potatoes. potatoes yeah hey junior call my potato herbie because it's fully loaded <laughs> what oh, dude, I can't hey, wait more sour cream for mine i feel like you guys didn't get the joke it's like herbie fully loaded there's a movie called herbie fully loaded about a car that's alive i think Lindsay lohan was in it dude there's something wrong with my baked oh, potato fuck me i guess What's oh my god that? dude it's like super baked See? what the oh, hell that is, is that super baked potato yeah that is one baked really potato. baked yeah, potato. Super lit, dude. wait a minute chef pb didn't get us drinks damn him yes <laughs> damn, damn your personal chef for not getting us drinks for the food he made you yeah, let me go get his drinks, yeah, guys. Yeah, damn it. All right, guys, it's prime time. Wait, do you have a drink? No, it's just the name of the drink, Joseph. Uh -huh. It's some kind of sports drink that athletes like. Junior, we're eating baked potatoes. We're not athletes. Just, I'm surprised. This, I think this is, like, the first time they've ever, like, showcased Prime in an actual SML video. I know, like, the par SML parody channels, like, SML YTP, Caleb 10, they've been obviously showing Prime in their videos for months now. But I think this is the first time I'm seeing Prime on an actual SML movie. Well, still drink it. It's good for you. I actually think I heard this drink is bad for you. Cody, athletes wouldn't drink something that's bad for them. Athletes don't do anything I heard mixed bad things well, about these concussions. That's bad for you. Well, they wouldn't drink something if they get paid millions of dollars that would hurt them. Henry Ruggs got drunk and killed a woman with his car, and he made millions of dollars. That's one athlete who made a tiny bad decision. Uh, oh, boy. Tiny. I mean, oh, star. wow. Well, then just drink it, because I know it has to be good for you. It's not. Gatorade's good for you. No. No. Gatorade? No. no. Wait, then what should athletes drink? Water. Wait water, unfortunately. Why do athletes drink water? This is disgusting, dude. I, I think they do drink water. No, they don't. Yeah, they, they do drink water. water. They, they just don't like drink it all the time. I mean, that's me. Hmm. And I, after the super I mean, me personally, since I'm sort of considered an athlete, sort of, um, obviously, water is the number one drink that I normally would drink. Um, other drinks that I would have are either Gatorade or like energy drinks. I know those aren't good for you, but like in the moment, I feel like I need it. And I know there's like better options out there, but I just said, I don't give a fuck. I'm just going to drink this. And, you know, I've obviously been knowing Gatorade and uh, like Prime. I've heard that it is bad for you because of the ingredients that it uses and all that kind of shit. But I just don't really pay attention to that as long as I have a drink that you know, gives me some energy for the moment, then that's fine, <laughs> and all that stuff, I mean, yeah, I don't really mind that much, so, mm-hmm. Well, you never see the team dump a bucket of water on the coach. Yeah, I mean, I guess that's true. Yeah, they always dump the water it. spots or anything big, so what if, guys, I have a quadrillion dollar idea, what if we re-release water? Re-release water. Re water? How is that even possible? Water. Yes, we can, we can call it Water 2, or the sequel. Water 2, the squeakle. And we, and we put the squeakle. The what? Yo, or we call it H2O2. Ooh, 
this fancy. What? Like and your H2O2 is hydrogen peroxide. Okay, then we'll call it H2O2, not hydrogen peroxide. It'll sell like hotcakes. Oh, boy. Hot oil. Everyone would think oh that's God, way. That's random. Right 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 this is not a huge idea. Let's go to the drawing board. Oh, you got okay. to be rich. All right, guys. The first what the hell is that? To the squeak wool is here. Junior, you can't sell this. Why? Because you don't own the rights to Alvin and the Chipmunks. I'm pretty sure the whole world owns the rights to Alvin and the Chipmunks. No, they don't. Yeah, dude, it's it's a movie or a show. No, it's not, and neither is SpongeBob. What? Okay, well then turn the ball around. Look at the other cover. H two O two, not hydrogen peroxide. Well, at least you can sell that as long as you take Alvin off. Cody, I'm yeah. not taking Alvin off. Alvin's what's gonna sell the bottle. Well, you're gonna have to change the bottle anyway because I'm pretty sure this is just a prime bottle that you changed the label on. <laughs> I mean, if you really want to have Alvin the Chick Month there, then try to design a character that looks somewhat like him, but not exactly. That could work. You could have a Chick Month as your uh, mascot. You just can't use that because if you do and you make millions, you're gonna get sued. Oh, this is a bottle I got made in a factory. No, I see the label behind you. <laughs> okay, fine, it's a prime bottle, but I dump the prime out and I put in other stuff. What kind of water is even in here? It's water from the sink downstairs. Oh Junior, my God. nobody's gonna pay for bottled tap water. But it has electrolytes, dude. No, what? it doesn't. What it's is... just tap water. Listen, it has to be just water because it's water too. It's the sequel. What makes it different? The two, duh. Yeah, the, the big two. Of course. When people see famous athletes drinking H2O2, they're gonna want it. Imagine watching Patrick Mahomes drink it before the Super Bowl. Imagine watching LeBron James drink it before I think Patrick Mahomes something else before through. the Super Bowl. How are you gonna get LeBron James to drink this? He poured it in his mouth. No, I mean, how are you going to convince LeBron James to drink this? I'll message him on Instagram and say, yo, Bron Bron, yo, King Bron James, please Bron. drink our drink. I don't think he's gonna answer. No. no I think it'd be better if Joseph messages him, because I'm... Yeah. Okay. Oh my god. Yeah, I just don't think LeBron's gonna answer a white kid's message. Dude, he doesn't play in 1950s. I'm pretty sure he would have messaged you. Just message LeBron. But bro, I messaged him like five times on five different accounts. He doesn't ever reply. Why won't he notice me? It's too What'd popular. <sighs> I, I'm a meat writer, but I'm. A <laughs> Wait, let me read me. that. What'd you say to him? <sighs> LeBron. LeBron, my glorious king, I would lick the sweat off your feet just to get a taste of greatness. I'm not a meat writer. I'm a meat writer, and I'm not vegan. Sprite Cranberry is my favorite soda. You... What the fuck kind of message is that? Yeah, yeah, I'm not surprised he's not responded to you. I get he has... Wow, 159 million followers. So even then, he wouldn't see this regardless because he's just too damn popular. But I highly doubt he would want to mess respond to you back with that kind of message. I mean, if I saw a DM like that on Instagram, I am never talking to you ever. I I'm a meat writer, but I'm no vegan. Chili. Sprite cranberry is my favorite soda. <laughs> Sprite cranberry is my favorite soda. James is way too famous to answer our messages. So we need like another celebrity. Ooh, what about Tom Brady? Maybe he can endorse this. No, he's hmm. retired. And besides, he already has that TV 12 bullshit. Well, Jimmy Butler likes coffee too much, so we can't ask him. Uh, we need a famous athlete that's not too famous. Like super famous, but not famous. Like an athlete that still goes to Walmart. Well, do you know any Walmart celebrities? Hmm. <gasps> oh, that Caitlin Clark girl in the WNBA. Uh, oh, dude, she's Walmart worthy. Yeah, she's really famous. I've been hearing some things she about her. She still shops at Walmart. Yeah, I could picture her changing tires in the automotive section. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, so, like, she's, like, really famous. She's, like, the most famous WNBA player. So she's, like, on the same level as, like, a Walmart manager. Yeah. Okay, well, how are you going to get in touch with Caitlin Clark? Um, I could message her on Instagram. Ooh, how about we just call her agent? Yeah, we can do that. Right, I'll, I'll call her agent, and then maybe we can end up on The View and talk about our drink. Oh boy, the view. I can meet Whoopi Goldberg. Yes. All right, guys, it's ringing. Hello, Caitlin Clark's agent speaking. Uh, CEO of Water 2, the Squeakle speaking. Uh, okay, what is this call about? Well, we have an amazing sponsorship opportunity for Miss Caitlin Clark. Oh, that sounds awesome. What's the sponsorship? Well, it's the newest, biggest, amazing sports drink that's taken the world by storm. It's called H2O2. Water 2, the Squeakle. H2O2, not hydrogen peroxide. Wait, wait, wait. Squeakle, like Alvin and the Chipmunks? Uh, well, we're not sure if we're going to keep that name because I don't own Alvin. Okay, well, what's your budget? Uh, hold on, ma'am. Let me speak to my CFO. Cody, what's the budget? What, I'm the CFO. <laughs> <I'll tell you laughs> okay. I have like $20. 20 we have bucks. like $20. We'll take it. The WNBA doesn't pay that much. Wow. Awesome. Okay, we got a deal. I'm surprised. We'll be right over. Okay. Guys, Caitlin Clark agent accepted the deal. Wow, that was easy. That was easier than I thought. You better remove Alvin and the chicken right there. Hello? Hello, this 
is Caitlin Clark. Hi, Mrs. Caitlin Clark. Oh, crap. Land. I always wanted to meet you. Where's her $20? Oh, Cody, give her the $20. I'll hit you. Okay. All right, so for that $20, what we want you to do is we want you to be the main spokesman for our famous drink. Cody, grab it, grab it, grab it. No, I don't hear you. Okay, so it's called Water 2, the squeak wool. There's an album in the chipmunks on it. Or it's called H2O2, not hydrogen peroxide. So what we want you to do is before every game, we want you to drink it. And in interviews, we want you to say that this is this is the reason why you play good, and it's yummy, and you like to drink it. How is it? How's it taste? <laughs> I think she likes it, guys. It's the electrolytes, dude. Yummy. Wait, what? <laughs> so, anyway, <laughs> what? I think you guys should just, you know, go make a commercial for us and tell everyone that makes you like it. me like you basketball. I know, I know, big guy. Come on, let's go. Big guy. Oh my god. Does he really I like it or is he just saying that? I don't know if she likes it or not. I don't go. think she oh likes it. Guys, let's turn on the WNBA and see if Caitlin Clark made a commercial for Water 2. Caitlin Clark doesn't score 17.6 points per game because she's good. She does it because she drinks water too. Oh my god. It's like water, but better. Junior's it's gonna get too sued. Good. Shit, my water. Yummy. I like it. Junior's gonna get sued. Guys, she did it! She actually made a commercial for water too! Dude, that was so sick! She said the name of the drink wrong. She called it chipmunk water. It doesn't <laughs> matter what she calls it, Cody. It's still free exposure. It wasn't free. It was 20 bucks. Look, let's just watch her play basketball and see how she plays after drinking water, too. Losing my about to take a free throw. Oh, got to take a sip of that chipmunk water first. And that's the spit tank. Spitters are quitters, Steve. Let's see how it works. Caitlin's down. Guys, Caitlin's down. She's down. Wait, what? Spit tank. Spitters are quitters, Steve. No, no, Caitlin's down. Wait, wait, what the fuck? Caitlin's down. She's down. She's standing totally still. Uh, you guys don't think it had something. I didn't realize she fell down. I thought the camera was just panning up to the hoop. I didn't think she fell down. Oh, maybe she sprained her ankle or something. She was standing totally still. Uh, you guys don't think it had something to do with her drinking water too, right? I mean, it was just normal tap water. I don't see what could be wrong. I don't think she was. She wasn't drinking it. She was just putting it in her mouth and spitting it out. I don't think that's really gonna hydrate her body well. Breaking news. Breaking Sewage There's a boil water notice because there was a sewage leak into the water company's water supply. So make oh, sure you no. Oh, no. no. Junior, didn't you say the water 2 bottle was filled with tap water? Yeah, what's the problem? What's a boil water notice? It means the water's contaminated and you need to boil it before you can drink it. Damn. Wait a minute, you can't drink boiling hot water. It would burn your mouth. No, not boiling water. Boiled water. You drink it after it's cooled down. That sounds like a waste of time. Just drink a ball of water. <gasps> Wait, I have another hit idea. That's a trillion dollar idea. We should sell bottled boiling hot water. What? Dude, what? That's so genius. You know, it's you know when you make mac and cheese, you have to wait for the water to boil before you put the macaroni in. Imagine you go in the fridge and grab a bottle of boiling hot water. It's already hot, and you just pour it in the pot. No oh, man, the convenience. <laughs> Junior, you can't sell boiling hot water. By the time people buy it, it'll already be cooled down. That's why we would sell it in ovens. You know, like in the grocery store, there's a bunch of refrigerators. We have a bunch of ovens just already hot, and you just reach in. So and you don't have to bowl. buy a bunch of ovens. Burn you. No, it'd be like in a Stanley cup. A Stanley cup? Yeah, like a cauldron. A cauldron Stanley cup that's gonna cost more than the water. Well, listen, you pull the cauldron out and then you just put it in your refrigerator, it stays hot for you. It's not gonna stay hot in the refrigerator. Your business idea does not make any sense. The Stanley cup stays cold for 72, hot for 72 hours, cold and hot. This is stupid. But yeah, look, we'll, we'll work on this problem because uh, we have another problem. I don't think that's gonna work. Breaking news! Breaking news! Dies. Kaylin Clark has died from sepsis. She must have drank something yucky. Oh my god, Junior, we killed Caitlin Clark. Oh no. Now, calm down, Cody. How do you know that's our fault? Because she got sepsis from the water we gave her. How do you know she wasn't drinking out of the toilet earlier? What? What? Hey, we're suing you guys for killing Caitlin Clark. Wait, no, I'm out of here, dude. Yeah, I'm out of here, too. Wait, no, go, 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 go. I need you to go to court with me, please. I promise I'll tell him you had nothing to do with it. Okay. All right, we're ready for court. Oh no. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. Well, I kind of expected Junior to get sued. Not like this. ...of Cody and Julia, who are being sued by Caitlin Clark's family for serving her a drink which contained contaminated water, which resulted in her death. Wait, wait, wait. Your Honor, don't say my name first. This was all Junior's idea. I didn't have anything to do with any of this. No, Cody, you said this drink was a good idea. You're the one who gave me the not hydrogen peroxide. My God. Oh. No, I told you that H2O2 was hydrogen peroxide. And I wouldn't have known that unless you told me, so you helped think of the name. Oh, no, 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 no. Jesus Christ. Listen, kids, someone died here. 
You gave Caitlin Clark a contaminated drink. Okay, hold up. Water 2 is not contaminated. It's like water, but better. It's too good. Stop quoting the commercial. Okay, look, we filled up the bottles with water from the sink. I didn't think it would kill anybody. Bro. Well, obviously, you didn't hear about the boil water notice. Afterwards. Which, leak, which contaminated our local tap water facility. I find you guilty of murder by negligence. And I will punish you. Very they didn't hear about it until afterwards. Twenty thousand dollars. Good going, Junior. Junior, what the fuck? You said you were gonna tell him I had nothing to do with this. Well, I didn't want to lie to the judge. You came up with the whole idea. What the fuck are you talking about? No, I didn't. Listen, we have to find a way to come up with twenty thousand dollars, Cody. How are we gonna do that? Maybe uh, there's someone at the door trying to buy our entire water juice. No. Supply. Our entire supply. We only had one bottle. Uh, let's just go see who it is. Hello? <gasps> Uncle Ian from Alvin and the Chip. Let me guess, he's yeah, serious. That's right, it's me, TV's David Cross. Hey, you make this shit? Oh yeah, that's our brand, Water 2. No, no, see that? That's mine. That's the Chipmunk. I own the Chipmunks, okay? Let's go to court, come on. Oh, I get I knew it. I knew it. Twice. Today we will again be hearing the case of Junior and Cody, who are being sued by Uncle Ian for trademark infringement when they sold a bottle of water that had a picture of Alvin the Chipmunk from Alvin this would and happen. the Chipmunks on it. Uncle Ian, show me the proof of this infringement. Uh, look at the bottle. That's Alvin right there. Let me see this bottle here. Yes, that is literally a picture of Alvin the Chipmunk from Alvin and the Chipmunks. And look at here, it even says the squiggle. I'm sure that's trademarked as well. Then I find Junior and Cody guilty of trademark infringement and sentence them to pay $20,000. Another $20,000? $20, $20, wow, Junior! Junior, what the fuck? Now we owe $40,000! All because Junior could not remove a picture. Oh, no. Is this another lawsuit? Hey there, I represent Prime Sports Drinks and you stole our bottle. Come on, let's go to court. Oh, I didn't steal it. I did. Order, 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 order. I am the Honorable Judge Poor. And today we will be hearing the case of... <laughs> oh my God. Is he going to get said multiple times and the judge Poop is going to be like, forget it. No way in hell. <laughs> Junior and Cody again? Who did you boys do this time? You're being sued again? I hope you have a lot of money. Well, no, it seems that they have no money whatsoever. Sports drink for stealing the prime bottle and selling your own water to drink in it. Prime I'm surprised they noticed. What proof do you have? Well, you see, the bottle's literally the same. They just put their own label on it. Let's see. Well, these really are just exactly the same bottles, aren't they? And look, Alvin is still on there. You haven't learned anything, have you? Well, Junior and Cody, I find you guilty of stealing a bottle design. Or really, just reusing a bottle. And I offer you to pay the prime sports drink company $20,000. Another $20,000. $20,000? God fucking damn it, Junior! Let me get the door. Sorry, I'm mad this time. Motherfucker! Oh my god! <laughs> My God! Oh no! 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 No!
we need it. Junior, this is check fraud. It doesn't matter. The water company has so much money, they're not going to notice. You wrote $60,000. Dollars. Dollars. <laughs> dollars. I didn't see that. Dollars. The bank's not going to care that it says dollars. And for the date, you just wrote today. <laughs> but tomorrow? No way. And why did you write finding down there? <laughs> because it says Mimo. No, it says Oh, my God. It's <laughs> They said Mimo like Nemo, and we had to guess the movie. Nemo, the not Nemo. Did they put a captcha on the check? I don't know what they do. No, Junior, if we cash this, we're going to go to jail. And why did you put my name on it? I'm not going to go to jail with you. We both needed the money, so I put both of our names. Look, what's the worst that can happen? Go to jail. Oh. I guess. And today, no way. Oh, my God. Oh, no, I am tired of this. I sentence both of you to death. The world is a better place. Oh, my God. <laughs> well, I guess there's no escape out of this. <laughs> My god, what is your favorite drink? Um, I don't know what my favorite drink is. I drink a lot of different things. Either water, obviously. Um, Gatorade for like stuff like the gym or just uh, the job that I'm working at right now. Or the, the side job, kind of. Um, I also drink Diet Coke when I drink like when I like have like a big meal or like when it's like when it's like a big meal I have like a Diet Coke on the side. I don't drink regular Coke anymore That or protein shakes. So I have a lot of different drinks that I enjoy I don't know what's like my favorite of all of them. So but that's just a list of things that I normally would drink I love protein shakes. I like Diet Coke when I'm drinking when I'm adding a big meal water is good obviously when I'm like in the gym or doing something intense to where I need to hydrate myself, especially with Gatorade as well. I don't know what my favorite drink is. I used to say root beer, but I kind of stopped drinking root beer and just switched to the Diet Coke. So, yeah. Oh my god, this whole episode, Junior kept on... It was mainly Junior. Cody was just there along. He kept on fucking up getting sued four times. Four times. I thought he was only going to get sued one time because of the Alpha and the Chickmunk um copyright infringement but no um the basketball player died Ke oh i forgot her name I, I don't watch wnba so i don't know much about that they kill a basketball player got sued for that they um they uh, got sued for alvin and the chick month twice they, th so that's two times and then they got sued for the prime bottle um does they got sued for stealing the prime bottle and using it for their product and then they're getting sued for check fraud. Bruh. Anyways, guys, I'm not gonna lie. This is a pretty entertaining episode. This is a longer video than normal. I mean, Logan did say on the community post that he was gonna make a, like a 16 minute long video today. So I was, or yesterday. So I was kind of expecting it. But honestly, this was pretty entertaining. Even though it was just Junior being f fucking dumb and keep going to court. It was entertaining regardless, so if I had to grade this, I'll probably give it like maybe like a solid B. I feel like it's a I feel like it's a B. It's pretty entertaining and it deserved a uh around a B. <sighs> Anyways guys, if you ever decide to start selling something, don't do what Junior did. Get sued four times and then send it to death. <laughs> Anyways, guys, if you did enjoy this, then be sure to give this video a like. If you haven't yet subscribed, then be sure to do so right now and turn on notifications to be notified for any video that I upload. And I'll catch you guys later in the next one whenever I start doing that. So, hope you guys enjoy. I'll catch you guys later. So, take care. I'll try my best. If, like, SMO said they're going to upload tomorrow, I think. So, if SMO does upload tomorrow, I will try my best to get to it that same day. I know recently I've been getting to SMO videos leaked, but I had an excuse for most of them i mean i was on vacation for 10 days so i obviously missed like five smo videos and before that i would miss a few of them as well and then get to them the next day but i'm gonna try my best to reduce that even though i can't promise that so you guys are gonna have to bear with me okay guys i have a life i have things going on so anyways guys with that being said if you did enjoy this i actually had said all this already so take care